Baby Audio just released their Parallel Aggressor. This plugin can take your audio from here to here. I'm Marlon and welcome to the White Noise Studio. Please remember to subscribe and hit the notification bell so you know when there's a new video online on this channel. A channel to help you out in recording, mixing and mastering. As the name implies, the Parallel Aggressor is a parallel processor focused on the blend between your original dry audio, a heavily compressed version of your audio called Spank, and a heavily saturated duplicate version called Heat. The blend between these three sliders make up the sound of the Parallel Aggressor. Let's check out what it does on the Master Bus. The plugin is divided into three parts. In the middle you find the mixer for the three elements. The left side is for the spank and the right side for the heat. A nice touch is that the Parallel Aggressor comes with three different kinds of skin. A night skin, a day skin and something in between. Both left and right side have a dedicated meter to help you out getting the right settings. You turn up the spank and heat dials just before they start to become orange for the ideal settings. Of course, if it fits what you're after, you can crank them to the max or dial them back. Each of the left and right sections come with their own style knobs which basically add an extra flavor to the sound. On the left section you find extra punch which brings the 4 against 3 synth more forward in this loop. Here's the extra smack dial which alters the compression setting to be more aggressive. Here's a sidechain filter to let the low end more untouched if you want to keep a bigger bottom end and the spank section can be switched to mono which can be helpful if you're focusing on a very strong center in the master. The right section has the extra hot button, so more saturation. And the tone switch for a variation in tone. I at least notice a boost in the lower mids. Also included are a high and low pass. The high pass sounds like a 12 dB at 50 Hz and the low pass like a 24 dB around 9 kHz. But don't quote me on that. There is an auto gain function which works pretty fine. It allows you to hear what your changes do to the sound instead of having your judgment be skewed by louder is better. You can see what the plugin does when you check the peaks with a limiter with a nice graphical display like this FabFilter L2. This is on and this is off. It's pretty clear how the peaks get reduced and with the metering you see the overall loudness reduced with the parallel aggressor enabled. So let's quickly match the volumes. Well, the matching is not perfect, but you can hear now how the mix gets fuller, glues more and has more punch. To me, this is a sort of a quick and easy plugin to beef up your mixes and add glue to your master. The smart use of the free sliders for dry and wet controls, combined with the added controls and the auto gain makes that you really cannot get a bad setting with the parallel aggressor. I can clearly see its usage on separate buses like drums, synths and guitars too. And this is a plugin which will certainly be useful for you, especially when you need to get work done. I don't want to dive into too many settings. Please remember to subscribe to this channel and hit that like button. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!